you came out, you were the most hyped up guy. I think you ran into a horse before the game. What got you so fired up about being here today? Uh, just, you know, last week we didn't have the greatest week at, uh, as a corner room, and we really wanted to uh, be relentless. Like Coach Locke said all week, was be relentless and bounce back. So I just felt like I had to be, as I'm the older guy in the room, mm -hmm. I just wanted to bring the energy to everybody in the room and, and to the team. How surprised were you that that horse was standing behind you? <laughs> it was it was very, definitely surprising when I turned around. The horse was right there, yeah. but I tried to I tried to play it off like it like it was nothing. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the 60 minute effort tonight, not just in the second half, but being able to hold them to field goals before you know intermission. What was the key defensively to containing a Virginia team that's averaging over 30 points a game? It was all about uh, our mentality as a defense. Uh, this whole week, our mentality has been don't flinch. So when they have a big play, they go down, have a good drive, just not flinching and making a stand, bend, don't break mentality. That was the biggest uh, mindset for us this week. For you guys kind of as a corner room and overall as a defense, it seems like turnovers just kind of attract, attract you guys like magnets. There have been so many already this season. Is it something specific you guys maybe work on and practice, maybe disguise coverage, anything like that, or is it just kind of you're in the right place at the right time? Well, I think it's a lot about our coaches preparing us throughout the week and us just doing our jobs as a, as a unit. So we disguise well, we do our job, and the ball will find you when you do the right things. What's it like leading a group of young cornerbacks? Almost everybody who's playing is what, how, what three or four years younger than you are. Uh, yeah, it's it's definitely it's definitely different. You know, um, this is my first year being like the oldest guy in the room, and having to lead them guys is just it's just a privilege, honestly, just to show them the ropes and show them the, how it goes in college football. So being able to lead them is is actually a phenomenal experience. Second half, you guys pitch a shutout, hold them to under 100 yards after the break. What, was, what, what things kind of ratcheted up there for you guys? Uh, in the locker room at halftime, we were, we were all just calm, staying together, and uh, really embraced our mentality of not flinching. We really, really came together and knew that the game was going to be on the defense. The offense was going to come, but if we wanted to win, we can't let them score anymore, and that's our mindset throughout the rest of the game. All right. Thank you, Jalen. Appreciate it. Thank you.